Would you guys like to say anything to the camera? Just make the appropriate flight. Yeah, Stephen Matheny will spend the next 12 and a half years behind bars. It started back in 2008 when he lied on forest service contract bids. The then vice president of the company Carson needed to weigh and submit the weight of nine helicopters in order to qualify for forest service money. Two of those choppers were not built yet. One of those was the crash helicopter. There were a total of nine helicopters that had falsified weight and balance and fictitious power performance charts. In January 2008, Levi Phillips, the former director of maintenance for Carson, created a formula to estimate the weight. Now, did he intend on, um, on the death of anybody? No, uh, there's no evidence of that. A national investigation shows the crash helicopter weighed 4,000 pounds more than the original estimate submitted to the Forest Service. And this isn't just flying from one airport to another. This is out fighting fire, uh, wildfires. For the sentencing Tuesday, a federal judge told Matheny his poor decisions are the reason for the crash. She said no airplane gauges or other warnings could have saved the men because they trusted the original numbers of the charts. Too emotional to speak on camera, family members say the judge made the right decision. In a previous conversation, one woman said she hopes this day brings closure for everyone. It's very painful to know that somebody is responsible for this over money and greed and selfishness. Matheny will have three years of supervision after he's released.